Yeah, hello there. My name is Roger and today we're gonna play along with the light from the window. And to help me, I have this flower, my D850 and a 50mm 1.4. Uh, and what we're gonna do, I'm gonna try to, um, um, to balance the light because it's quite hush light now. Uh, it's quite hush, so I'm gonna try to, to play with it. Uh, the first thing I do, the I do is um, have the aperture to 1.4. And on the shutter speed of 6400 and 100 ISO. Uh, and then I have underexposed the whole uh, frame. Um, I will try to, to keep a little bit more light. And then we see, um, I also put up on some um, highlight uh, warning. That means it blink when it's too, too light. Uh, and here we see, it's gonna have a little bit of blink in, in the white parts. Uh, maybe I will keep that. Uh, let's play a little longer because I want to copy the light from the window on this side because it's quite dark. Uh, and because I'm inside my house, I can't go out because we have this virus shit going on. Uh, but my kitchen is on the next next room, and those we have to make pizzas and everything. And a simple task is to take this one and that one and merge them like this. A little bit noisy. And here we go. You see, I can pick up some light and make it quite quite good. Let's see how it's gonna turn out. Make focus there. Yeah, quite good. Um, I will recompose a little bit more. Here we go. Perfect. So if you want to make some uh, some good uh, portrait or whatever on the window go to the kitchen make your own reflector because uh, this and also see um, because it's not uh, completely I will do like this and the light is going to be more movement in it or what you call it perfect so we take another one more light and as you can see, I'm quite high, so I love my, my screen. I can look down instead to break my neck every time. Yeah, it's quite good. So uh, go to the kitchen and find something to uh, reflect the light. It's gonna help you a lot. Okay, here we go again. Uh, tip number two. Uh, on the first pictures, I had the, the reflection from the other side of the flower. And now we're gonna see the light is quite harsh again straight on the flower. Okay, what could I do? Um, I will try to remove some light. That means I could use my, my professional gear, like this one. Um, then you see approximately 70% of the light is, is gone. Still dark on this side, but it's a little bit better. But this is cheating. You put it away, and you can use something you have back home from a bedroom. Make it clean. And then I'm gonna put it up. One on this side, let's see. And on the other side. And here we go. Then you see the light is better, but it's still dark on this side. Okay, we go back to the kitchen. I pick up some, some more help. And now it's gonna have some, some perfect light, I think. Here we go, one more, like that. Good. So uh, with uh, some, uh, some simple thing that you have back home from the bedroom and the kitchen, you can play with light instead to wait out of that. Because as you can see, uh, this light is gonna be harsh for some hours, but I will play now. So play along and see you next week. Bye.